Hey guys, so today I want to show you the startup I'm building and each week I'm going to release a video of the progress up until I release and then afterwards I'll still uh, upload progress videos showing you guys the process and journey of building a startup. So the idea is uh, to create a marketplace for developers where they can sell files, uh, repos, and links to their products. So basically this would be some uh, similar to like WAP.com, but more geared towards uh, developers to sell their products. So some examples of things you'd be able to sell is, for instance, my website, SAS Planet, where I'm selling a Next.js uh, SAS boilerplate kit. Instead of having to handle the delivery myself, because whenever someone buys on here, I have to add them to the GitHub repo. Or if someone bought it and I had files, I'd have to send them the files or I'd have to implement my, my own system to automa auto automate that. So using uh, my startup product scale, uh, you'd be able to automate all that and you'd be able to create a product, attach a GitHub repo or upload files and then when someone buys it, it's automatically delivered. And this would be solely focused on developers. So it would be a great place for people who want to build their own stuff to go here and buy things like templates, uh, like landing pages, UI components, stuff like that, and repos. So overall, I think it would be a great utility uh, for developer community to have, to have one place to upload all their stuff. Um, other, th uh, other examples of things uh, would be like this guy who made Shipfast, is he could upload his repo on the product scale and it would automatically be delivered. So tons of things you could do with it, uh, tons of things to upload. So to get into what I have so far is if you go to productscale.io, you can sign up for the wait list uh, and you'll be notified of updates and when, we, when it's available for you to create an account. So to get into kind of the tech stack is I started with my own boilerplate, uh, which you can get on sasplanet.org. Um, I started with that. It's a Next.js project. Um, I kind of modified, I organized things in these folders in the app directory just because there's going to be so many pages as it grows that everything has to be organized uh, or else it'll, things will slow down. Um, I have a components folder with a component library uh, that comes with my product SAS plane, but I also added a bunch of components, the rest of the components from Shad CN. Uh, I also have separated out each of the forms into their own uh, file, so I can just paste in this component uh, for all these forms anywhere I want, and I can have access to all these forms instead of just hard coding it in each page, which I think is great for composability, because I might want to do these form actions somewhere else. So if we come back to the, so this is on localhost, this is not available yet. But this is the dashboard for the sellers. So as you see here, like this new product button uh, is attached to a form for creating a product. And I can just paste this component anywhere to get this button and to get this uh, form to pop up. So this is the seller dashboard. Um, in here is where you will upload the files and the GitHub repos. So basically for here, like, for instance, if someone created this, you would upload a file. First, you'd give it a name, like project files. You click next. And then you'd upload a file, for instance, uh, like this. It, it can be anything. And once it's uploaded, you see, let me read it. So as you see, you have this file uploaded. And then you can attach a price to it, kind of like Stripe. If you use Stripe before, this will be familiar. So I've attached a price. In case you want to have multiple tiers, you can attach different prices. You can upload, you can edit the description using MDX. So like, you can use MDX to uh, make a fancy description. You can save that. And you can upload images. So now for this, if I wanted to see what the product page looked like, Every developer will have their own kind of store page. So for this uh, little store, you can give people your store link or they can find it in the marketplace. So there's kind of two sides to it. You can give people just your products using your store link 
uh, for instance, this company called Ship Saturday, which I've made up, would just be forward slash Ship Saturday, uh, Ship Saturday, and you could give people this link. Um, so when you click into a product, uh, you'll see all the payment options. So this is like my Next.js SaaS kit. You'd be able to buy it on here, and it comes with project files, as you see here. And you'd be able to check out all in one place. So instead of me having to wait for someone to buy and then manually add them to the GitHub repo, this would take care of all that. Um, but you can also do it for other things. So for instance, if you made a bunch of React email templates, uh, you could sell that here as well. And you could also use it, uh, you could put this link in your bio. So for instance, I could put this progscale.io forward slash SAS planet link in my bio so people will have one place to view all my products instead of either having to make my own website, which might cost money and take a lot of time, or having to uh, find some other place to upload my stuff to. So back to the dashboard. The things I've completed so far is like the basic user auth, which came with my SAS kit, and the, also the ability to create stores. So uh, once it gets more, uh, more progress is made, I'll release it so people can start uploading products, but we're not quite there yet. So, so far you can just make your store. And also uh, I've modified the auth pages. So I've created the auth login page. So that's kind of the, the progress so far. Next week, uh, next week or the week after that, I should have it so people can start uh, using the site uh, in a kind of beta mode. So things might still break. It won't be as stable as when we launch it for real. But next week or next week or the week after that, I definitely uh, should have some people being able to sign up and buy stuff and upload stuff. Um, so if you want to stay updated, you can subscribe to my channel or join the Discord below, which uh, in the Discord I'll be posting updates and kind of hanging out and answering questions. And this is the last week you can use code LAUNCH15 on my website to get 15% off my SaaS kit. So if you guys have any questions about the startup or the idea or the concept, you can leave a comment below or join the Discord.